Hey folks, what's up? Welcome to Earhawks Minis. Today, I finally got my hands on Gorzag Git Stampa and Nick It. Okay, so release day for Gorzag Git Stampa and Nick It has come and gone. Uh, my shop here in Taipei did not have any, uh, but my dad was able to grab one of these for me from our local back in the States. Thanks, Dad. I'm really excited to get started on this model. He will be part of a collaboration coming up in the future, so be sure to watch all the way through and find out what's going on with that. And also you can subscribe to see that video when it comes out. So let's get this guy out of the box and take a look and get him put together. In the box we have one single sprue and two bases and we also have this little assembly guide which probably really don't need um, but there it is I think it also has like uh, yeah, some rules if you're if you're gonna play them in a game I am not so I don't really don't need that so our sprue has both Gorzag and Nicket on it. We got a base for each here. And we'll take a look at the sprue. Um, taking a quick look, uh, it looks like it is pretty, pretty neat how they uh, have the assembly on this. With the hat as part of the arm, which is part of the, or part of the back, which is part of the shoulder pad. Um, yeah, it's kind of cool. The only thing that I'm thinking about doing uh, to change this guy is to give him more, a more exciting shoulder pad. But we will have to kind of dry fit them together and see how much of a hassle that's going to be. If it's going to be too much, I'll just leave it as is. So I'm going to grab clippers. Uh, we'll start taking this guy apart and get him cleaned up, put them together. Okay, so we have them all together here. Here's uh, Nickett's parts, here's Gorzak's parts. I'm gonna take a look at the book, see what order this goes in. Uh, we put the torso pieces together, stick the head on the front of the neck, um, stick, stick the arm on, um, stick the other arm on, put the shoulder pad and head on, yeah, okay. All right, so I'm gonna clean up these mold lines and we'll start putting them together and then we'll make the decision on that shoulder pad. Now this is the first I've had of what I'll call the new GW models, meaning that it came out after I started back into painting. So completely new to me um, since I've been back in. And I gotta say, they clean up really nice. <clears throat> Much easier and much more quickly than all the kits uh, that I've been doing so far. So that is really nice. Details on this model are really, really good. There's a nice contrast between the real crisp bits that are supposed to be nice and sharp details and the more subtle stuff like this tabard. It's a uh, really, really nice. I'm impressed. That part was super easy. That's it for Gorzeg. Take a look at Nicket real quick.
Alright, with Nicket done, I can say that that is the fastest and easiest cleanup I've ever had on a model. So let's start putting this guy together and make a decision on the shoulder pad. Nick it is even easier. It's just a head. All I gotta do is put the head on. So taking a look at Garzag all built up. Um, he goes together quite well. There's just a couple little minor spots that I will fill uh, right here. I'm gonna fill that with some sprue goo. And we'll get that shaped up. That will be fine. Everything else looks pretty good. Uh, went, went together quite well. It was super easy to clean up, really fast. It's a really nice looking sculpt. I will just then also go in and drill the gun barrel and he will be ready for primer. Now, like I said earlier, this model is going to be in another video. This will be a painting video and it's going to be a collaboration with the amazing Essex Boys channel. If you have not seen his stuff, you are really missing out. He does some amazing builds, really great painter. His videos are super fun. Link is in the description. Definitely go check him out. Give him a sub so that you can see his part of our collaboration video. If you like these kind of videos, I do do unboxings and reviews somewhat often. You can hit the subscribe and the bell button to know when all of the new videos are up. It's a really free and easy way to help support the channel. There are other ways you can help listed down in the description below if you want to take a look at those. So thanks for watching. Be safe. Be sane. Hope you have a lot of stuff to paint. A lot of time to paint it. I'll see you next time.